wasting some time here with a replay sent in by Bull Halsey, 96 of the Tier 10 Moskva Russian Cruiser. Let's uh, back off here to get a look at it. First replay I've uh, received actually of the, the Mos Moskva. So, you know, might as well uh, show off the ship, take a look at it, see how it uh, plays. And go back into uh, Bull, uh, his view here. It's pretty nice range on the uh, on the ship, 19.4. I don't know uh, what uh, upgrades he has on it, or not upgrades, so actually upgrades and uh, captain skills. We'll kind of try to see what uh, how it performs here. I'm only on the uh, what is the tier eight, the uh, the chappy. That's where I am with the uh, Russian cruisers. Probably need to go ahead and finish that up. That in a Tashkent. But uh, we're here on North Domination Mode. And somebody misses the Kitakami. It was uh, extremely derpy, and it uh, will be missed. Enemy Fletcher is close. Bull is going to slow down here, try to get some shots up on this guy. Look at that shell arc. That's a uh, strong Russian firepower right there. Is a uh, friend to miss there. The Otago. Man, look at those. Messing people up. Enemy New Orleans is uh, getting in close. That's one thing I never really understood about uh, the starting on the north side of this map when enemy cruisers or battleships got really close to the uh, middle caps. It's really dangerous, and uh, Bull is going to shoot some AP at that gentleman. Crewmaster. And selling broadside on that is a uh, paddling. More rounds, man. <laughs> what did... Uh, okay, he got the Fletcher with a fire. Alright. <laughs> uh, silly, silly Fletcher. Another enemy uh, destroyer right in front of uh, the bull here. Looks like he was going for the, the narrows beside him not to. Enemy destroyer, that is. Careful, this Moscow man. This is a big. Just look at this. This thing's just gigantic. It's huge. And you know, we'll be in a decent team player there, asking if his team is ready for uh, the radar on that smoke. Enemy turpits is coming around here. Bull is detected. And look at those shells, man. Those shells. And enemy destroyer is... Oh, there is a destroyer in C. See what it could be. Uh, Shimakaze Fletcher or Fabuki. And bold, uh, slow and steady. Wins the race. Enemy Fabuki around the corner. I'm pretty sure Bull is... Uh, just from what I'm seeing, I think he's not going to get a uh, face full of torps here first. Knows it's better to uh, slow down and not run into those. There we go. Looking for targets. Target selection, I'm not really understanding too much as far as zooming in, but some people play the game a bit different. I'm getting a f trying to get a fire on this uh, Iowa enemy New Orleans. Oh, he's <laughs> silly fellow. Decent uh, mitigation of the damage from those two battleships. Bolt does have torpedoes coming from the side here from uh, friendlies. Load some AP for this New Orleans. Is am I seeing right or? <laughs> His secondaries are shooting at it oh, near seven kilometers. Okay. And that guy's engine is out. And he's broadside. That's a silly, silly New Orleans. Going broadside to anything that close is uh, paddling. Enemy team is just hiding by these islands. Not really wanting to engage, seems like. And... 
Karama going broadside too. Your choices are not so great, comrade. There we go. Oh wow, three bounces. Lucky fellow. Just the uh, the massive hit pool of, of the Moscow coming into play here. Don't have to worry too much about uh, losing nearly twenty thousand HP when you have sixty five. And torpedoes. Come on, man. Look at this. Look at this torpedo spread off to the side of him. Really? They're shooting an island. <laughs> and the enemy team not uh, willing to push into only that one decap they've taken out. 51,000 damage with that uh, spanking those that one cruiser significantly. Another New Orleans crewmaster. I'm going to assume he's going to go broadside too. I don't know, just a guess. Man, I probably need to actually grind out my uh, my chappie to get this. The guns on this thing are silly. The Dimitri's uh, guns are also just, uh, just, just nasty guns to enemy cruisers. Do you see this kind of play from a lot of <laughs> from a lot of high tier cruisers? The uh, almost battleship style uh, nose in combat high tier because going broadside is so so punishing to you, and that guy's gonna probably take a lot of damage before he makes it out of that turn. Be surprised if he didn't get any more citadels right there. There we go. Oh, well, he got the last hit. <laughs> last 904 of that guy. Somebody else got to all the citadels from that broadside. Uh, man, enemy team is just completely annihilated. I do say the the first five minutes of a battle is uh, basically just killing the bad players. Uh, it's just what it is and when that happens in a high tier game and everybody on the enemy team is a bad player or they just made a lot of mistakes they could be good players it's just a 10 minute killing fest not a not a five minute thing and now oh yeah blood in the water now you can just charge this guy kill him he's gonna take probably two torpedoes there unless they run out yeah there's the two that gentleman is and he's on fire. Man. It's not what you want happening. <laughs> Three enemy cruisers running at you because uh because they can. You have nothing left to fight with or against the enemy here. And torpedoes. And kill number five for the crack and and the Moskva. Big low kind of sluggish ship it is just uh, dealing out a lot of damage for these guys shots out on that uh, Fabuki that's a swing and a mess but man the enemy team didn't put too much of a fight up that enemy Fletcher tried to get something done but didn't really engage with the rest of his team oh <laughs> uh, yeah phase rider just run away. There's not really too much else to do. And I think Bull may go around and try to hunt this uh, Fletcher. But it's all over besides the crying, though, at this point. You know, there's not really much going to be happening from the enemy team. Two ships. I'm going to take a look at that uh, Iowa. Iowa's going to go down pretty quick. Bull is... Uh, Fairly uh, fixed on getting this Fletcher. The Fletcher is going to go around the other side. Bull is a bit out of position to engage him, but uh, better safe than sorry. Friendly Otago should take this, uh, take him out actually pretty effectively. So, and Bull is going to try to back up and get that kill, man. <laughs> Let's check on that. Uh, yeah, the Iowa's just getting crushed. 
And Bowler, this Otago is probably going to kill this Fletcher pretty quick. See how it goes. Enemy team just got steamrolled. And there's some nice hits. And a torpedo from the Otago. Really? <laughs> Destroyer let itself get uh, torpedoed because reasons. And the last guy to die will be that Iowa. And he's just running for all he's worth. Not too much to do. Moscow, man. Those guns are serious. Not playing around with those guns on their ship. Gigantic hit, hit pull. Hit point, hit pull. What am I talking about? I don't know most of the time what I'm talking about, actually. I don't know if y'all realized that yet, but to the end screens, 105 hits landed, 105,000 damage. I like that. That's nice when that happens. When the numbers match, but uh, definitely contribute to the team there. Uh, but man, enemy team just not showing up for the battle. It does happen sometimes. Just kind of wanted to share the first uh, video I got of the Moscow sent in. Do you think you can do better? Send it in. Take a look. Hopefully you all enjoyed. Come and see me next time.